most of the speaking engagements that I get invited to. First of all, I've never done one outdoors. So I said to somebody, they said, where are you going to do your speaking event? I said, baby, I made it. I'm playing the garage. The media teaches us how to be prepared for every situation. From a reporter's standpoint, if you say no comment, what's the first thing that comes to my mind? You liar. You liar. <laughs> you are lying to me and I'm going to catch you. That's why you got to be ready. That's what I do as a strategist. I get people ready. Understand your personal and professional message. I just recently worked with an embassy in Washington, D.C. I did a year with this embassy. And I had to teach them because they said, we want to get more attention for what we do here in America. I said, we need to sell. And the foreign minister looked at me and said, we do not sell. He wasn't Russian. <laughs> we do not sell. Yes, you do, because we are all selling personally every day. Julia, yeah, but we're selling ourselves more than we ever did before. Answer the single most important question about your personal and professional image. Who do you think you are? Understand you hold the power of communicating every message to perfection. We live in a society today where facts are missing every single day. Stop it. Stop it. Be true to yourself. Be the master of everything you say and write that speaks to who you really are. If you tweet this, if you put it on your Facebook page, if you note it, you believe in it. Suddenly people are going to say, oops, that's something that they actually follow. Don't be a sucker. It's not right. It's not good. Be a whole hell of a lot smarter. Because you can be. Know the limitations and expectations of your reputation. How many people think it is possible to keep a perfect reputation at all times? Ooh, wh what? Impossible. You think it can be done? Can I have a hand up there? You think it can? Okay. All the time. How do you do it? Be invisible. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Claude Rains is coming out of the wall momentarily. Here he comes. Realize the power of what you say and never make excuses. Hey, you see, things I write are private. You see, I've heard all these excuses more times than I can count. And in the end, they are all just that. Excuses for those who fail to do one simple thing. Think of the consequences. Never stray from being smarter and more prepared than everyone else. I tell people today that we have the opportunity to be the most educated society on the history of the planet. And we do. All it takes is one of these. One of those phones. I can look up the facts in a heartbeat. How's everybody doing? I have often learned that when you begin a speech, the first thing to do is make sure that as you go through it and when you get to a certain point, you don't leave anybody to the point where they are bored and they want to leave. So thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. It's been a pleasure.